everyone and welcome to fixing tiny tedious things in this video i'm going to talk about sslforfree.com i have been using this website since two years and i use their 90 days of free ssl certificate option i have six certificates from sslforfree.com but recently they have made some changes to the website and now their ssl certificates come through zero ssl as you can see here never pay for ssl again powered by zero ssl okay so here is one of my websites topbootcamps.com the ssl certificate for this website also comes through ssl for free.com and this one expires in two to three days i'm making this video to show you the whole process how to renew it using ssl for free.com or zero ssl the new process some of my subscribers have already requested this so i'm making the video just copy the domain and enter here and click click on create free ssl certificate so this will automatically take you to zero ssl the new interface as you can see here ssl for free a trusted partner of zero ssl so right now with a free plan you only get up to three ssl certificates with 90 day of validity and we are only going to use the free plan right now but there are options of paid plans as well and i'll be showing the pricing for that later on so under these options none of my previous certificates appear for me to renew the new certificate i have to create a new one from scratch so for that we need to click on new certificate So if you are looking for a paid version, you need to toggle on this I need a wild card certificate. But right now we are only looking for the free SSL certificate. See, just follow me. So enter your domain here, topbootcamps.com. So click on next step. Here it shows the options 90 day certificate or one year certificate. One year certificate comes with a paid subscription. So I'm skipping that for now. So let's click on 90 day certificate and click on next step. Again, click on next step. Here are the plans. So the free plan is $0 per month and it is free forever, but you have the option of just three 90 day certificates with this one. And with this basic plan, you get unlimited 90 day certificates and then three one year certificates, then multi-domain certs. I may go ahead and upgrade to this plan later on, but for now let's stick with free one and click on next step now the next option is to verify the domain name which can be done through these three methods but the one which we which most of the people use and find easiest is http file upload so click on http file upload and sign into your C panel. I'm already signed in. So here is my C panel and the domain root where I have to do the settings. So let's go back to SSL for free or zero SSL. This is the file you need to download. So let's click on download this file first. I'm downloading it on my desktop. Now the next option is you need to create a subfolder inside dot well known. Earlier we used to have Acme challenge as I'm going to show you right now so here is the C panel here is a dot well known and this is the folder we use to work with but right now we need to create a new folder so let's click on new folder and give it a name make sure you copy this name from here so that you do not make any spelling errors Now hit create new folder. Now go inside this folder and upload the auth file. Here is the auth file. Now we need to make sure that this file is successfully uploaded by clicking here. Okay, so this file is successfully uploaded. Now we need to click on next step. 
and it will ask you to verify domain click on verify domain okay congratulations your domain have been verified all right so now it is generating the certificate so let's wait for it it might take some time i tried it on my google chrome first and it didn't work that time so i went into google's chrome's incognito mode because that worked with ssl for free.com as well so let's see all right so the certificate has been issued and is ready for installation to continue please follow these steps below okay so server format default format these are the options i'm going to click cpanel and then click on download certificate.zip i'll be downloading it on my desktop again and let's click on next step these are the steps that you have to follow now download your certificate using button above okay we have already done that follow these steps listed on this page done installing check installation so what i have to do is i have to now go ahead and uh, take this information extract the files go to this folder and have to get this information from these three files and paste inside my cpanel i have to go to first cpanel and look for ssl tls here it is click on it click on manage ssl sites now pick the website for which you are installing the ssl certificate this is the one which i'm going to use which expire on 26th of may so let's click on update certificate this is where we have to paste the information we got through zero ssl so let's go back to the desktop and here is the certificate ca bundle and private key these three information for these three fields certificate private key and ca bundle so let's go ahead and extract the info right click and click on edit with notepad control a control c go back paste here now let's go to go and get the private key sorry that was ca bundle I, my mistake that's that was ca bundle here now the next thing is private key right click with notepad copy this information as well you can right click and pop, uh, extract the information by clicking on right uh, open it with notepad i have notepad plus so i opened with notepad plus go back this is a private key now the next option is certificate for that let's go back to the folder click here add it with notepad control a control c go back paste here control v okay all done let's click on install certificate so that's pretty much it it's done let me show you the validity now okay see here this is extended for next three months okay so this is what you have to do to install ssl certificate using this new website zero ssl which is also a part of ssl for free.com if you want to go ahead with a paid version of that zero ssl 
you can follow the link through my description i'll get some sort of commission if you purchase a paid subscription from the website all right so follow along and generate an ssl certificate for your website using https version thank you so much for watching